Back to the ground for Watson. He's in for the Texas touchdown. Close to 200 yards in the first half last week. Turpin with a double pass. Out in front of Rager and picked off. Caden Stearns the interception. That's not something he's going to be accustomed to doing. You know, looking off a safety like that. They'll throw it. In zone. Rager for the TCU touchdown. And the Horn Frogs back in front beating the first half buzzer. Again, looking downfield and an interception. Brandon Jones gift wrapped. Ellinger pressured again. Stands in. End zone! What a catch! Colin Johnson! Tie game! Well, let's confirm that he caught the football. Six foot six needed the full extension. And yes, indeed. What a throw. What a play. And this is what they've been waiting for from this young man to have these sorts of splash plays, these sorts of momentum changes for the Texas Longhorns. Now Robinson. An interception. Second of the day for Caden Stearns. He will take this one inside the five. It, it, it looks like, unless a foot stepped out, not right there. As it looks like on the three yard line, you can see his left foot stepped out. So this, and that looks pretty definitive. So this should be coming back. Nonetheless, that's right here. Left foot out, and the ball was about at the three. Either way, though, what a play by the true freshman. His second interception of the day. If you're Gary Patterson, you have to kind of be beside yourself. These are the sorts of mistakes that lost you a game last week versus Ohio State in the second half. And now, all of a sudden, when it, when it happens to After further review, during the return, the runner stepped out of bounds. With the ball at the two and a half yard line. So the initial down. call with a hammer, Young. Ellinger pulled it. Touchdown, Texas. It just delayed the inevitable. Ellinger scans, steps up, steps back. Heaves one for Humphrey. LJ Humphrey, Texas touchdown. Here in his second season, he's got the Longhorns at three and one with back to back wins over big time opponents, USC and then TCU in front of incredible atmospheres here at DKR. And the scary thing is, I think as this team continues to gain confidence, they're only going to get better. They're only going to get more consistent. Big 12 better watch out. This Texas team is about ready to be something special.